When you're ready to share your notebook, you'll find the option here in the backstage. Since this notebook is on SkyDrive and I'm signed in, I can invite people to share the notebook. I enter their email addresses, select if they can edit or can view the notebook, provide a brief message. If I want to, I can require them to sign in to access the notebook, click Share, and an invitation is sent via email. Now I'm signed in as Dave, and an email just came from Sean about a shared notebook. I click the link in the email, and it opens the notebook in my browser. Wow, it really looks good. I can even edit the notebook in my browser, because when Sean shared the notebook with me, he selected Can Edit. I can also open and edit the notebook in the OneNote 2013 application if I want the additional functionality it offers, such as enhanced insert and search features. We're back in the OneNote application. Another way to share a notebook is to create a sharing link. You can create a link for viewing the notebook, editing the notebook, and give them to whoever you want. And when you no longer want to share a notebook with a sharing link, you simply disable it. Now you've got a pretty good idea of what's involved in creating and using your first OneNote 2013 notebook.